How y'all mold wax lives? I think it's time to play a little Seven Days to Die. Uh, so, as you can see, uh, I don't have any stuff. Um, and it's day one. Uh, but, all is not lost. I was able to... Okay, I was able to copy my world, but for whatever reason, it didn't let me copy my... Uh, dang it. Alright, let's go get this quest done real quick. And then I can try and head back to my base. Um, but yeah, uh, uh, it won't let me copy my character for whatever reason. I don't really understand where the character files are kept, honestly. Uh, uh, I feel like there's some kind of issue with um, the profile associated with the map. And so when I fixed my map saved file, I lost the connection to my character and it's connecting to the character I had. So basically what I had to do was uh, there's some files um, that I had to replace to get my map working again and the process of getting the map working again deleted all of my um, player stuff, right? And, well, it didn't delete it. It's just not pointed to by my map anymore. And so it's pointing to the new empty player profile rather than my old player profile and copying over my player profile information to the new map did not fix it. So, I don't know how to fix my character. Oh, but you you remember that I looted things, apparently. What can I get you today? You can just let me complete that quest so I can go on about my business. Uh, but Unfortunately, that means I have to start with the uh, all right, save away point hardware, save away point. Um, can mark these with these, I think. Traders. Hi, lady. That is the tiniest police department. Uh, so I'm trying to get to here. Uh, I believe that's my home right there. Uh, <laughs> I tell you what, I had, I've had to wander around for, it's about an hour now, um, since I've been messing with this. Uh, yeah, just, I think right around an hour, a little over an hour, somewhere in there. Trying to get this file, which is great, you know, cause I have so much free time. I can just waste on nonsense like this. Um, it's just pushing me closer and closer to build a new PC. Uh, which, you know, it's been a while. I probably need to. Um, I have a really good video card if it's not the culprit. So I can skip that part, uh, which really brings the price down on um, putting together a new PC. Uh, my only real issue is I wanted to put a lot of RAM in my system again, and that is going to be expensive. Um, everything else is fairly cheap, and I mean, none of it's cheap. Let's be honest here. 
but yeah, I'm leaning more and more toward building a new system just to get away from the blue screen nonsense I've been having. It's getting worse and worse. Um, I did price one out um, here a little bit ago because uh, of all the issues I was having with my mouse. But, uh, yeah. I'm going to have to hunt down things. Uh, I was debating if I needed a new case. I kind of feel like I do. I I think I need to look carefully. Um, so uh, the system I have now has got uh, a self-contained um, water cooling thing that I really like. But it was a thing that I installed. And it didn't fit the case exactly. <laughs> and so I... Uh, I would like to try and find a system that fits a little better. If it's in the case, fine. Um, it doesn't match up um, fan size wise to the case. And so it has a smaller fan than the, um, than the uh, uh, fan screen on the top of the case which is um which meant that I had to use uh I had to put the screws through the fan through the screen holes and so it's not mounted to the screw holes it's mounted to the screen holes which isn't an issue it's just you know it didn't fit exactly right and I would like one that fits right I did buy uh, the case, I don't know what brand the case is, uh, Corsair maybe. Um, I, I specifically bought the case because it was the same brand as the cooling system. And I assumed that their cooling system would match up to their case. I was wrong. Um... And, uh, but I never used one of those before, so I have a better understanding of it now. Uh, but I definitely want to go with water cooling again. It is so much better than what I had before. Uh, okay. So that spot I thought was my base turns out not to be my base. So we're going to have to play, where's my base? Um, it must be... That's my base. Did I walk past it? Is that what I did? I did. That's my base right there. I don't even know what kind of backup equipment I have. I guess I'm going to have to make sure to to keep a backup of all my gear. The downside is is that once I get up here and get some gear is that now I got to go try to figure out where I left my mini bike. Okay, bed roll. In place, uh, map. Home. Okay. 
Okay, we've got a wrench. Uh, oh, look at that. We got an axe. That's handy. Um, because at least got some puncher. Uh, I don't think any of this is have any armor or anything. Still got all my metal supplies though. Uh, I don't think I can make a pickaxe, can I? Nope. Do I have any skill points? I've got four points. Uh, let's see. Unlocks all iron tools like pickaxes. Okay. Uh, but then we got to come back over here because I have got to get some points into things. Uh, I need point in living off the land so that I get more seeds. I need... Um, Let's go ahead and throw a point into this since I'm doing punching. And we'll throw a point into smarts here. All right, so I don't have a lot of supplies. Oh, shoot. You know what? But I do have some supplies. Uh, okay, so now, now I need uh, 30 forged iron. Uh, I've got the wood. I need leather and duct tape. Uh, duct tape, leather, and I need uh, five, six, six forged iron. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I uh, got more time in on Forbidden West. Um, it, uh, it got a glitch in it, unfortunately. Um, I ran into this quest where you, um, uh, this woman tells you that her father, uh, attacked her and, uh, disappeared into the forest and she wants you to go and find him and so um so i uh went into the forest to find him and he um he has dementia and he thinks, or has something like that. So he thinks that, um, uh, well, no, he, he, uh, he alternates between what's going on and, um, what happened in the past, basically. And so, uh, when he was younger, he was in a group of um, fighters, and they all got killed except for him. And so he keeps popping back to that day, and so what he's doing is he's going out to the memorial where the ambush happened, um, thinking that uh, he's with his soldier buddies and so when you get there um the memorial has been damaged and so you follow him and you try to um get the piece missing from the memorial so this is a unique quest item that's only available from the quest uh it's not it's not a random item that i can get someplace else and bring it to him and so I don't know if it's 
how I looted, but I do see that other people are having the same issue, uh, and that it's random, apparently, which scrap pile it's in, and uh, uh, I didn't get one. <laughs> and so the quest is just stuck, waiting for me to loot the scrap piles I've already looted. And I didn't get my piece, and they don't regenerate, as far as I can tell. Uh, which is weird, because scrap piles other places, I believe, do regenerate. But the, because this is stuck in a quest loop, the dude is just standing there, telling me to scan for scrap piles in the area. And there are no more scrap piles that I haven't looted, but I did not get the quest piece. Which sucks. Uh, so I'm not entirely sure where I left my bike. I think it must be out here, right? Because I went to this little west town and um, looted that gun store last time. So I'm going to guess that if it still exists, it is parked outside of that place. Also, it's funny. I'm going to end up with a better pickaxe than I had before because I can make level twos and I was running around with level one. Uh do I have any mods that would be good for it? Uh no, nothing I can really use the mo can I make a baton? I can. Pipe glue leather. I keep my pipes on me, so I don't have any pipes. Um, so that's a no. All right. We'll have to try and either get some pipes or my hands on a baton. We'll just have to stick with the old puncher for now. I mean, I like the puncher, so that's not that big of an issue. Should have put a point into sexual Tyrannosaurus. I think that's the one that uh, lets me run longer without running out of steam. Okay, that's already been looted. Already been looted. But yeah, at least it was a side quest and not a main quest because, you know, the answer is, oh, just reload your previous saved game. I'm not making those. I... I just haven't. I I made a couple, but you know it's on the PS5. Um, you don't you don't really shut down your games. Uh, they just kind of go into suspend mode. So when I start the game back up that I'm playing, uh, it's just running, and so I've been. Just relying on the auto saves. Um, I mean, I, I do a quick save every time I, not every time, but most of the time when I come across a campfire, there's quick save and then there's manual save. Um, the problem is, is that the issue occurred a while ago and I've done a bunch of stuff since then. And, uh, and so I don't, I definitely don't have a saved game to go back to. So that doesn't help me. It doesn't help me to tell me to reload a saved game. Uh, um, I think I talked about the games I got. I got uh, three or two of my board games from my Kickstarters came in. Uh, I'm still super excited to play them. Uh, did not get a chance this weekend. I uh, unfortunately, um, one of them is going to take a while uh, because it's a. Well, one of them is actually two games and several expansions for those two games. Um, the Nemesis game I talked about. 
and uh, uh, so my plan had been on uh, usually on Fridays, not usually, often, hmm, often on Fridays I play a game with my nephew, but a board game, uh, and so I thought we would get a chance to play it, and um, I ended up recording a bunch on Friday uh, last week instead. And so I didn't get a chance to to play it. And so then I was going to uh, pick up on or play it on Saturday uh, with him. But uh, he didn't go to bed till like 3 a.m. And so I didn't want to deal with his cranky britches. Uh, so, <laughs> um, cause I'm a cranky britches kind of person myself. And there's only so much cranky I can take. But maybe this week we'll get a chance. Uh, I, uh, I was really surprised not to play the other game because my sister was really looking forward to playing it. And then, uh, she, uh. She went off uh, with one of her friends and uh, spent the spent the night over at their place. Um, they live like way north, so it was a it was to do. I think they met in the middle and rented a room and hung out. Um, went to uh restaurant kind of stuff and uh so then they uh so when i got up uh on saturday uh, my brother-in-law left a note that he was going to go pick her up and they'd be back for lunch and so i'm like oh well you know they're going to get back about two o'clock and uh, and so that would be right in the middle of trying to play the game. So I didn't, um, I didn't want to get into something that was going to take multiple hours because, you know, I'm sure the kids would have to do stuff or whatever. And so, uh, So, um, I decided not to do it. And then Sunday that we just, we didn't, we didn't play anything. Uh, so yeah, uh, I did however, get an email, a pair of emails on, uh, Saturday, I think, um, for two more of my Kickstarter games, uh, ask me to confirm my my address. So, uh, yeah, I'm excited. Uh, one of them. So, K Kickstarter, uh, if you've never seen it, is like a crowdfunding thing where you fund something before it's made, and you have to get bonuses for for crowdfunding. Like you get it cheaper. Uh, and so you're basically paying for them to develop the game and then you might get a, a bonus. Like, like I said, there's, there's often like little, uh, extra pieces that you only get for the Kickstarter version. Um, or, uh, or, um, okay, must be at this end. Or, um, there might be, uh, uh, you get a huge discount on it, that kind of stuff. Uh, or a combination of the two, even. And so, uh, that is, uh, 
that is, um, or sometimes uh, they're only available through the Kickstarter. Like they're never going to be. I think okay. Well, here's the here's the mat I put down, but I don't see my mini bike anywhere. Dang it! Why is everything else here but not my mini bike? I mean, it still could be here, right? Maybe I just put my mini bike down and is that what caused the game to crash is the mini bike that's why it's not here now I wouldn't be shocked if that's what happened but I ran all the way out here I mean, I know it won't show up on my map because it's not mine. I have to pick it up and put it back down. But I don't see it at all. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty sure it should have been right here near the uh near the store. Which is still looted. Man. Totally Stole my mini bike and all my stuff off me. You dirty game. You dirty computer. Uh, but yeah, uh, so um, one of the games is early and one of the games is late. Um, they give you an estimate of when it might be out. But, you know it's an estimate and so chances are it's not going to be out when they say um uh a lot of it has to do with uh, uh manufacturing um the uh having been part of multiple kickstarters now um some for video games uh some for board games uh some books is a new one. I, uh, I was, my favorite author did a uh, Kickstarter for some books. So I don't know. Why I did that. I wanted to go in and loot this place. Um, and uh yeah so it's uh it's a uh it's an interesting system uh can i fit through here no okay can i do this though Um, so yeah, so I'm excited to get uh, a, a game based off of the movie The Thing and a uh, fantasy uh, dungeon crawler kind of game. Uh, that um, It looks pretty awesome. Bard Sung is the name of the fantasy crawler, and uh, the thing. Uh, 
strangely enough, this is the second thing Kickstarter I have been part of, uh, which is weird. Uh, I like the first thing game I got, board game. Usually there's a way out. How do I get out? Great. My guy's got such low stamina at the moment. Um... But, uh, yeah, this, uh, uh, I like the first one, uh, but it's a different kind of game than the second one. Uh, the first game is more of a psychological thing. Um, psychological thing, I don't know. I, I've never played a game like it. I'm used to board games where you're more cooperative. And, uh, the, so the first thing game I've got, it's, um, it's cooperative, Except that if you're infected, uh, because that's what the thing movie is about, is being infected by an alien organism that, uh, not so much infected as consumed and duplicated, I guess. Uh, so if you're a, a thing duplicate, then um, your goal is to uh, consume everybody, right? So in the the first board game I've got, um, I haven't got the second one, so I don't know the exact rules to it yet. But in the first one I got, you, uh, someone's infected. Um, you deal out, uh, infection cards at the start of the game, and one of the cards is going to be the infected person. And so you don't, you don't know who's going to be infected. Uh, and so... Um, and so you go through and, um, pick a mission, uh, and so someone plays the leader for a round and you pick a mission and then, uh, everybody puts in cards that will, um, help or hinder the mission. But the cards are, are uh, handed in and then shuffled face down so that you don't know who handed in which card. And uh, and then you flip over the cards one by one to see what happened. Um, and then um, basically a mission might be like, I don't know, uh, secure the fuel. And so you've got to... Uh, have like this amount of rope cards or something. I don't know. I don't remember. It's been well since I played the game. And so everybody is trying to give you cards that will benefit. Uh, they might not have rope cards. And so, uh, all right. Um, this one, right? No, what's the running one? This one. No. Is it this one? No. Uh, is it this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, that should help. And, uh, so yeah, so then you, you never know who's infected and, and, uh, the infection grows as the game goes along. Uh, so other people might get infected and you're trying to complete these missions until, uh, until either you or th the infected 
escape. Oh, well, I'm out of stamina. Oh, but I got that chicken. Cool. Well, uh, and then the new one seems to be more of a work together, um, fight monsters kind of thing, I think, uh, compared to the other one. Although I like the other one. Uh, I've played it a couple times now. Uh, it works better with a larger group, though. And, oh, great. Right, so what do I need to repair this? Uh, repaired with leather. Okay. Uh, well, with that, uh, I think it's time to call it a day. So, be brave of the small things, lean the light. I will talk to you later.